Hello friends, today we are going to study about cross multiplication method for solving any pair of linear equation with two variables. Here we are having a pair of linear equation with two variables. First of all, when we are solving cross multiplication method, we have to arrange the data or the equations in standard form. And what is the standard form that we know? That ax plus by plus c is equal to 0. This is the standard form. First we are going to arrange it as 3x plus 4y minus 10 equal to 0 and 2x minus 2y minus 2 equal to 0. Then we have to find a1 3 8 b1 4 c1 minus 10 a2 equals to 2 b2 equals to minus 2 generally students are forgetting to take this minus sign with the number and c2 equals to minus 2. now one formula for solving any equation with cross multiplication and the formula is x upon bc minus bc y upon ca minus ca and 1 upon ab minus ab this is not the formula but we have to keep b1 b2 so i will give you a easy trick to remember remember this actually it is b1 c2 b2 c1 minus 1 2 2 1 1 2 2 1 1 2 2 1 so easily you can remember this formula that x upon bc minus bc then ca minus ca then ab minus ab and then keep 1 2 2 1 1 2 2 1 1 2 so easily you can remember this formula now we have to keep this value if we will directly keep this value here i think there are chances that you make some mistake or in addition subtraction or multiplication so they are giving some tricks in textbook also they are giving or in any reference book also they are giving this trick what you have to do you you know we had started with bc so first we will make pair of b then c then a and then again b so i am writing the numbers here you know, so that you can it's 4 minus 2 then minus 10 minus 2 then 3 2 and 4 minus 2 now what we have to do b1 c2 means from here up down then from here to here means 4 into minus 2 this is b1 as and this is b2 this is c1 and c2 so directly b1 into c2 so directly we can write like this x upon 4 into minus 2 minus 8 bracket then minus then b2 means this from this minus minus plus and 2 tens are 20 y upon c1 means from up we have to go downside minus 10 into 20 means minus 20 minus 2 into 3 means minus and then minus 2 into 3 will become minus 6 1 here we had done this now 3 into 2 means 3 into minus 2 minus 6 then minus sign then 2 into 4 8 so here we will get so this way you easily you can put the numbers if you will do directly you will keep then there are chances that you make some mistake now you have to solve this x upon minus 8 minus 20 minus 28 y upon minus 20 this minus minus will become plus minus 20 plus 6 so minus 20 plus 6 will become minus 40 and 1 by minus 6 minus 8 so minus 40 now what you have to do here we are having a variable and we are here we are not having variable so one time we will take x upon minus 28 is equal to 1 by minus 40 and here also again y upon minus 14 is equal to 1 by minus 14. actually is this all three are equal so first we had taken this equal to this and then this equal to this why we are taking because we are having variable and here we are not having so we, when we will take this in equal we will get the value of this variable and when we are taking this to equal then we are getting variable value of this variable so it will be this minus 28 will go that side x is equal to minus 28 
by minus 14 minus cancelled 1 and 2 so we get x is equal to 2 similarly we can solve here also this minus 14 will go in the numerator again this minus minus also cancelled and 14 also cancelled so y is equal to 1 so this way we can solve any linear equation in two variable with cross multiplication method if you like my video please subscribe to my channel thank you so much for watching my video thank you